bit of, I don't know, like Cornish wear type cup. There's lots of um, pen tops and yeah. things like that. Yeah, here's a broken screw top jar, early sign. He's a modernish. I mean, if this field here is a dump, yeah. along here is where you basically see things sticking out. Yeah. No. Uh, is it in Imperial? Size Colgate Colgate toothpaste There's a little screw top glass jar here Oh yeah It's quite sweet Screw top But it's the best find yet it's kind of broken our bottle top, we don't, think, we don't think there's any age to it. A bit of pottery. It's got a bit of blue on it. Yeah, and it's like the base of a cup, isn't it? Back here, we've blocked this before, and and did come away with a decent enough haul. I remember the toy coach that we found. I love that from the sixes. Very nice. Uh, there is stuff here, but there's a covering. Oh, huh. It's a little kitten heel. A little kitten heel. This really knows this sort of stuff. A little bit of decorative blue and white pottery. Oops, dropped it. It's quite nice. What's that? There you go. Look. What have you found? Roll on deodorants Body and spray deodorant. Uh, plastic. plastic. Yeah. 60s? Yeah. yeah. 60s, early 70s. Yeah. Oh, I just dropped that. Bit of blue and white. There it is. Set. Yeah. What is it? Um, Langley's or something. Something. Uh, is it to do set your hair or something? Yeah. Look, what's this? Oh, I thought that was Lego for a minute. Judy just found the oldest thing so far. Unbroken. That's a fine. That's coming with us. Ooh. I'm a bit of uh, pottery, that's uh, Julie's fan. Quite faded blue. Quite full there. But it's a find. What's that milk glass? It's a milk glass jar, but it's not. I'm just broke. Is it ponds? Uh, oh. 
doesn't say on the bottom. Oh, okay. I think Judy just found a, oh yeah, a little dolly uh, saucer, plate. It's plastic, yeah. Well, we've got to take a little bit of uh, well, some uh, plastic away uh, with us. I wonder what that is. It's plastic, so we'll take it. I'm trying to work out what that is. It looks like rubber. Yeah, there's a lot of rubber items. Yeah. It's too soft for. Uh, Vulcan, right? I don't know if it is a cap to something. I don't think it is. Because like, if you press that in, you wouldn't really have anything to get hold of to pull it out. Oh, Robertson's jam. I um, found a few of these in the past. That's obviously broken to smithereens, but. Yeah. Plastic again. What's that? Bit of a show. It is, isn't it? Some little pottery shows here. That looks like a bit of willow pattern to me. On the edge of it. A piece there. You just spotted this. Hull. Is it hull? It's a little milk glass. Look at that. Yeah. A little cutie. Ponds. Is it a ponds? It is. It's got stones stuck in it. Actually, it's relatively it's clean. clean. It? Yeah. It's a screw top pond, but it's a nice little one. Yes. It's like a jam jar. It's like it's got a lid on it yeah. still. We forgot the trail out the cow. <laughs> ah. It looks like a Hartley's to me. Uh, I think it's too narrow for a Hartley's. Yeah. Too narrow for jam, you think? Let's get numbers. Oh, oh. oh. Carished. Yeah, don't know. It's not jam, I don't think. Nah. Oh! What? Two good things. What's that? Uh -huh. a, a little. What you get? Plastic. Piece of. Alright. And a piece of uh, pottery. See, that's the thing I think we might find quite a bit of is plastic toys. That's what I thought. Anyway. Yeah. You know, what old plastic toys are worth finding. Oh, yeah, they're interesting. Yeah. And it just goes to prove how long they last. Yeah. They don't biodegrade down, do they? No. Nah. Got this pottery here. <laughs> yeah. You ever had that? Wanted to get every last drop out of it. <laughs> metal as well, it's the old metal type, not plastic. Toothpaste that is. Toothpaste chew. Yeah, toothpaste chew. What's that over there, Adam? Is that broken? I can't see Post pot. It. What's here? Yeah. That's the bottom one, it's broken. Oh, is it? Ah, is aqua? Oh. Yeah. Bit of uh, plumbing. The first <coughs> bit of dolly. Not much left of that leg. That's for sure. Classic again. Five toes. Yeah, five toes. It's a human. <laughs> Keep that. Well, keep it to take off out of the woods. There's a ball. Looks like a dog's ball. And, uh,
I've got this in this root. Well, that's a well, that's a whiskey. Could well be screw top. Yep, yeah, they say we we always used to find a ball when we went larking, but but there's been about sort of eight nine months where we haven't found one. And here we go, a ball. I saw something. Oh, that. There's some telltale uh, signs there. 60s. Look at that boy, man. <laughs> uh, gem. I reckon that's teeth whitener, isn't it? I don't know. Yeah. Toothbrush. All plastic. Uh, and whatever that is. Plastic again. We forgot our trail to oh. us in the car. It's, it's a good work. It's a good half a mile away. Uh, should have went back for it to be honest. Oh, that's glass. Ah. Plastic lid. Do you know what that looks like to me? A bright water bottle. Yeah. Oh, look, a padlock. Could well be. A little rusty padlock. I'll take that. Look, old stockings. Oh. Part of old stockings. Mm -hmm. I wouldn't like to say if they're nylon or with yeah. the. I reckon if not gripe water, cough mixture or something. Yeah. Maybe old it. comb over there. But... Yeah. There's another little bottle here. And I think that's a cap because that's not screw top. I can see something. Is that blue? Where? What is that? Is it yeah, out somewhere? that is blue. It's sure look. It's, I think it's ceramic. Is it, is it plastic again? No, I think it's a ceramic. Can you bend down? I can't bend down there. I think it will come out. No. Bottle of. There's a blue bottle. Look at magnesia? Yeah, probably. Very dark. Yeah, yeah I would say milk magnesia. Oh, what's that? Uh, I think that would have that, uh, I think that was said Danish. Danish bacon? Yeah, possibly. I think it's like an it's a like a supermarket yeah. clip a uh, clip that clips yeah. it's like it. on the shelves. Yeah, yeah, definitely. I think that's part of a toy gun. Yeah. Um, Look, what, what, this is interesting. What's that? What, a brick. Is it a brick? Yeah. Oh yeah. It's got numbers on the side. Have a look. One 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 eight eight two. Whole so, jar there. I don't know what it is. Yeah, it looks like an air brick, but it's a strange place to have a number. Look. 
Probably a Hallix jar, I think. Oval team. Yeah. That looks like a top of a paste. Yeah. Yeah, still got the rubber seal on it. Nice. That's older. Yeah, I'd that's quite say. nice. That can go in the. Uh... Huh. Half a toy plastic. It's a figure. It's a figure, yeah. And got a little uh, thing on the bottom. <coughs> ah, look at this. What? A plastic half a crown. Oh, fishing. Yeah, two and six. No. Oh, that's brilliant. Look, an old roller. Huh, yeah, hair, hair roller. You know, look, six, it doesn't seem that long ago, but if you think about it, it's 70 years ago. Oh. Maybe a little screw up. Yeah, 70 years. Most of this uh, stuff. It's incredible. So it, it's definitely classed as vintage. Yeah. You know, like if we see all this new in a in a trendy vintage shop we're going wow look at that you have to find some marbles yeah well, well I mean like, I remember playing marbles in the 60s oh definitely yeah that's all I ever did oh I've sort of <laughs> told them our ages now <laughs> we don't care we are on the wrong side of 60 <laughs> Ah, oh, now this is interesting. Oh, look! What? Oh, Charles Show. Well, so on. The Charles Show. Now that... Oh, I know what that's for. That's for baby milk. Fairex, that is. It's got, the, it's got Fairex on it. Yeah, baby milk, yeah? No, Fairex is baby food. Baby food. Old bit of film. Yeah. Negative. There's yeah. another half crown there. Oh wow. Look at this. We We're in the money bob. today. We're in the money today. We found five bob. We found five rich. bob. Five bob was five shillings. Two half a crowns made five shillings. Much better money than what we've got today. Real money. Worth something. Yeah, unless it was plastic. <laughs> <laughs> well, unless it was plastic. Oh, that's very interesting. Yeah. And they were heavy like that. Had a couple of them in your pocket and you knew you had them. Yeah. And it was a night out. Fish and chips. This looks interesting. Bottle of Corona. That's not another roll on, is it? I think it might be. Yeah. But it's porcelain. It's milk glass. Yeah. Milk glass, sorry, yeah. Milk glass. Brilliant. This is the best corner. It is a beautiful little wood, this. And this remains of an old tip that is just popping through. It doesn't really spoil the beauty. Well, it's like it does if you look down. But to us larkers, it's all good fun. Wear bowl. It's got Tupperware ah. there. My mum had exactly the same ones in the 60s. Did she? Yeah. Tupperware. <laughs> you used to have your breakfast out of them? Yeah. Did you? Yeah, I could just imagine a bowl of cornflakes. Hot or cold milk? Oh, I don't like them with hot milk. Oh, oh no, they go all soggy. If you have them with cold milk, they've still got the crispiness about them. The crunch. Judy's put most of this here. 
washing up liquid. I don't know that, mate. Something bright. It's a nice little cap bottle. Electric lamp holder. Now, I've never heard of that, this one. Dermacil. Sparkling. This is just one squeeze of Lux with Dermacil. Rich, long lasting lava. Not heard of that one before. A flat, flat bottom woman's shoe. Nivea Nivea cream, little bit of bling, one of them uh, baby feed spoons, probably dry milk or something like that. That sort of sums up the uh, 60s rubbish bin really. There's a cat there. <laughs> Can you read what that says? It says farmer's wife. I don't know what what it is. Farmer's wife. Alright, let's take that. Let's see if I can wash it to see what the rest says. Okay. Yeah, okay. Julie's just put an R White's bottle with the lid on. Be good to have a look at that. That's interesting. That's a roller bearing. Not sure what that would have come out. Not sure it would have been a wheel bearing as such. Not the car anyway. It may have been, but I've changed many wheel bearings. Chuck it. I wonder if this is old or new, as in somebody's been throwing it to a dog. I don't know. I don't see no dog teeth marks in it. Now, if you put that R White's bottle around here somewhere, I don't see it. it is? Is it down there? Up. Oh, the whites. Is it sat on the cat? Could do. Probably. It's a bit grubby. Oh, and it says it on the bottom. Oh, they certainly did want to know. Oh, look at that fungus. I don't know if that's been knocked off a tray or it's growing on the ground. Wow. One of them large bumblebees. Because they actually hibernate underground. So like, it's nice and warm now, so they're coming out. And actually, they may have been out for a while. Yeah. I'm going to leave that here. <laughs> Should we just give me this? Another 60s. Sure, that's that for Charles. Probably 10 or 11 year old. Maybe 9. I just found a poison. You just found a poison? Yeah, but it's not got poison on it, but. Look. Ooh, a nice line. Screw top. But, I reckon that's fine of the uh, lock. What else she's found here? Has that got a broken top? I'm not sure. Oh, that's, that's dinky. That's cute. That can go in the bag. Judy's just made that noise. That, ooh! What is it? No. It's a bottle stopper. 
Ah, dimply pattern. Yeah, I know they used to have them in the 60s because by now you used to have those guineas used to have yeah. those on. I yeah. That. yeah, but don't forget as well, it could have been old rubbish clearing out a shed or a loft. You never know. Right. This little milk glass pot, I mean, that would have been dinky. That would have been so small, like you couldn't even get your finger in there. Well, you probably could just. But that is small. Yeah, that's one shilling and eight pence. Oh, eight pennies. Didn't, didn't actually call them pence back then. Call them pennies, so one and eight. So another ten pennies, and that would have been half a crown. Remember we found the child's play half a crown. Look, that's definitely yeah. actual, look. When you see uh, Saint with old imperial work, uh, money you know it's pre EU Newly just found another bit of a child's uh, shoe and they're getting smaller I reckon that's a four or five year old that one what three two to three yeah it's four and I found this I meant to show you I think it's uh, off of a car or a bike lamp oh yeah oh yeah they were glass back then Lucas, guaranteed. Yeah. yeah. None of this plastic headlights that dull and fade. Good little tip. If you've got dull or faded plastic headlights, you can buy the expensive stuff to uh, buff them up, but use toothpaste. No. And what's she got? Tiny little shippings. Well, you have got enough to no, no, enough to do, enough to do your picnic sandwiches. If that, well, maybe if, if there was two of you. Definitely not if you got kids along with you. <laughs> Good old shippings. Of course, yeah, but it yeah. Could, yeah, fablon more like yeah, that. yeah. Piece of fablon. Whoops. And. Some other jars and stuff down there. Just found that screw top of the jar, but getting back to this. Yeah. You should use that for there's a Colgate toothpaste. Use that to cover uh, dining tables. Or anything. Really. And that may be the kitchen uh, units for the pull down uh, yeah. uh drawer side. Uh, normally that that's where you put your bread and your Buttered your bread and that, cover it with that. Yeah, I, I, can, I, th I think we found this before and spoke about it. Yeah, that certainly does remind me of being young. Yeah, and I think when we got our first uh, place, when I got my first place back in the uh, 70s, use a lot of that. Covers up my multitude of sins, to be honest. Sauce bottle, screw top. Broken bit of a uh, pottery, you can just see the lettering. 
a little bit of the manufacturer. This is the area where, well, about a year ago, we found the toy coach. Still got that earth somewhere, I can't remember where. That's out the battery. That's a battery cell. When they're functioning, that would have been one and a half volts, 1.5. Rusty old cap on a bottle. An old footpath there. It's right now. Kent County Council. Public football. Because up there, there's a kissing gate. So. Should we get a more round that field? Yeah. Right, we're trying to do our daily uh, steps today, combine it with this little bit of a uh, social history lark taking us back to our childhood but we can guarantee that none of this rubbish was ours because uh, a pair of us wasn't anywhere near this particular village and it's a beautiful part of the uh, Kent countryside here. Yeah. It really is. There goes our uh, jewelry. We went through that to Kissing Gate and now we're following this worn path across this pasture. We're no experts. I thought like a bit of knack knackered edge flint. Could be totally wrong, of course. So you really work with that. Yeah. So, what yeah. did you find? Right. Found a little. Ah. Bottle. Oh, looks like a little miniature spirit bottle. Yeah, screw top. Yeah, yeah. Probably brandy, whiskey. Mm -hmm. oh. like that. Yes. What have you found there? Oh. The remains of a garden. Uh, that may be the oldest thing we've found here, yes, you know? Yeah. Yeah, it well may be. It's quite bashed about. What's that over there? Top jar, is it? Yeah, is that embossed? I, I don't even think it's screw top. No, it's worse, isn't it? Oh, yeah. Is that say Canterbury? Um, contents 70. Four fluid ounces. Wow, that's pre metric, that's imperial. Okay. So, so that's got some age. Looks like a little cream box jar yeah, or something. Yeah. Maybe 60, 70 yeah. years. I'm going to take that. Defo. Have a tiny little bit of decorative pottery. Very delicate at that. Julia's just found a few bits. Let's go and have a look. A bone, a massive bone. Yeah. That's a little. Salad cream? Salad cream, little piece of pottery. That's another one of them. That's another miniatures. Yeah, miniatures and a little. Oh. That's a princess paste pot by the look of it. That's quite nice. Yeah. Is that really solid in there? Uh, I haven't tried to get it out yet. Seems it. 
look under here, look. It's got its own little greenhouse, look, a little. <laughs> Have a look. Bonk. Yeah. Yeah, some more heavy. Another little one. Got a baby that's uh, Julie's found. Mm. I think that was a small gum. Like it yeah, blue gum. Well, I think we're going to wrap things up here. Oh, smell varnish, look. Still see the brush. Yeah, you want to see what a 60s nail varnish looks like? There you go. Where's that some make on that? I can't read it. Where? No. Might see it on the bottom. No, it's not on the bottom, are we? Well, that brand wraps things up with this uh, amazing little uh, village that's got so much uh, history. It's called Aldington. And it's famous for the Aldington smuggling gang. 200, 300 uh, strong in its heyday. And the leader come through, come from the same uh, village as uh, Julie's great, great, great uh, grandfather. And uh, he must have known him. He must have known the leader, who was, was a chap called Ransley. And in the village, Ruckinge, still got the cottage there where he lived. And with the money that he earned, he did buy his own place not too far away. And I can't remember now, I've got the details indoors, and the gang comes come to an end after a shootout with government forces.
good. That was uh, a lovely uh, afternoon. Beautiful place, Alginton. And uh, we've been there before. And this is what we found. To be honest, it's not really sort of uh, just about the finds. It's such a lovely place. Lots of uh, history. Close to us, about eight miles away. Beautiful journey across Romney Bar. So I think my favourite is this little cat. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, I suppose the find of the day is that uh, I presume it's a poison. And that's it. Yeah. Short. I don't know really. Uh, I like the. Yeah, the yeah. Kitty's mummy, I like yeah. that. We found two of those, but lost one. We yeah. lost, we lost half a crown. Yeah, we lost half a crown. I don't know what so, happened to it. Really the annoying. little kitties. Oh yeah. Plate. Dog's house cute. Plate. Oh, that is a dog's ball, by the way. Yeah, we yeah. found a dog's ball. Google, chuck it, and they make loads of different types mm. of them. We did find a couple of olderish things, more older things there. Yeah. That's uh, the remains of a garden's mm -hmm. stopper. Yeah. And this one comes out of probably a beer bottle or something like that. Oh, yeah, that reminds you of your nan, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah. I spoke no beers for her, and uh, they always had those. Uh, <laughs> and how was you at the time? How old? Oh, I don't know, about six or seven. <laughs> something like that. Oh, yeah, Farmer's Wife, Double Apple Devon Cream. cream. Yeah, cow. Oh, I think it says cow and goat. Yeah. I think so, yeah. Yeah, it is. It's cow and goat. Yeah. So, as I said, it was about this, but... Uh, That's probably an old deodorant. Yeah, Did you yeah, Oh, yeah, it is an old yeah, deodorant. Yeah, 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 yeah. White glass, yeah. Uh, milk glass, yeah. and roller. We don't know what it is. Yeah, There's no yeah, name on it. Yeah. Cap look. That's a princess. Yeah. Oh, it's got it on it. Look, princess, yeah. pure foods. Pure pures. Uh, tiny little ponds or... Yeah, it's a ponds. Yeah, it's oh. got ponds on Oh, right. Yeah, it's yeah. got ponds. Oh. Yeah. So. Baby little shippums. Yeah. Little baby one. Yeah, yeah. Thanks for watching. Yeah. And, uh, thanks for subscribing. And uh, all those that haven't, please uh, subscribe. Hit the like uh, button if you enjoyed our content. And hit that uh, notification uh, bell. We're creeping uh, slowly up to 900. So let's see if we can do it. And. Uh, See you soon. Yeah. Bye. Bye.